Are you skipping workouts and feel guilty sometimes? Do you? Yeah, I know. Me too. <laughs> Don't be. We're gonna get into that. Hey, this is Jason Roselle, and welcome to Get Inspired, the official podcast and YouTube show that will empower your mind, body, business, social media branding, relationships, and anything that's holding you back from becoming the best version of you. Listen, before I became a TV personality, an author, a celebrity trainer, a life and wellness coach, and the founder of Caliente Fitness, I was broke, obese for 20 plus years, full of stretch marks, full of excuses, and most importantly, here's the deal, I was unhappy. I was able to change my life completely, and since then, I've helped thousands do the same. This show is gonna bring you awesome guests, tons of helpful programs that'll aid you, but most importantly, your questions and topics that will make this show your show. My question is this, are you ready to get inspired? Well, get ready, because the show starts now. This is a topic that, man, I struggled personally for so many years. So if you're someone that works out, is actively trying to lose weight, get in better shape, or maybe just maintain, right? And you've built this black and white system in your head of, oh my God, if I don't work out these days, life is over, right? Things are bad. I'm gonna gain weight. I'm gonna get skinny, right? I feel your pain. But I'm also here to unwind your brain, relax your brain, because life, sure, you gotta be productive, you gotta be busy, you gotta be busy doing the right things, right? Having fun and enjoying life too. So I want you to really just take a moment and whether you're a client of mine or not, I want you to just realize that, just like that saying, less is more really stick to that motto less is more quality over quantity you don't have to work out every day you don't have to be on a quote unquote diet every day to reach the results you want right or to maintain the results is it a humongous part of your lifestyle absolutely because it's part of mine, all of my clients, but do we have to do this every second and if we don't, things are gonna go horribly? No, the answer is no. Why do I say this? Example, you injure your knee, you injure your back, your shoulder, your foot, whatever it may be, right? That doesn't mean that life's over, that oh my God, I can't work out anymore. We don't just stop working out, we work around it, right? Your knee hurts, you can't do lunges, you can't do squats. We can do other things. We can work on the upper body, right? We can work around the knee and do specific exercises. That's what I really want you to start thinking of. Same thing applies with the days that you skip workouts, right? That also applies to rest days. You need rest days, right? But what I'm trying to express to you most importantly is that if you skip a workout, so say you're supposed to work out Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. Friday, you couldn't work out because you had to take care of the kids. You got to go to work, extra hours, whatever. They called you in the last minute. You don't panic. That's your off day. Let that be your off day, right? Let that be the day that you take time to do your work, to do other things. You can't work out on Saturday, whoop de doo don't stress. Let me read to you something that I wrote to one of my clients recently. And she was stressing. She got in an accident, big one. And she was depressed. I'm talking major depression. Woo, shaky, anxiety, the list goes on. And I simply wrote her this and it something clicked. So much that all the worries were gone, right? So between this and some of the coaching sessions that I do via Zoom and the phone weekly with my clients, it just something clicked. But this particularly, really, when she got back to me, she was like, oh my God. So let me read it to you. Guilt is such a waste of your energy. Doubting on the negative will never inspire you 
to do better. But would you rather make yourself feel worse for not reaching certain expectations? No, right? Don't let this hinder you. Not everything is black and white, just like when you're having a bad day. Does that mean the rest of the day and week and month is gonna go bad? No, but if you let it consume your head, your brain, your emotions, it will become a bad. So really evaluate yourself, take a step back, become that fly in the wall, become the fly in the wall and it's like, wait a minute, is it worth stressing over? Wait, I have to go to work. I got to take the kids here. Okay, I'll work out tomorrow, right? You got an injury. Can't work out for a few days. Wrong. You can't. You work around it. I hope this message not only inspired you, but it woke you up and it made you realize that there's so much more to life than being super strict. Because look, I can be super strict and you can be super strict, but life is so much more fun and much more happier when you have balance, you know? A lot of times we compare ourselves. Oh, well that person has all this money, you know? Yeah, but are they happy? Do they have an awesome partner, husband, wife, right? Kids, are they traveling? Are they doing the things they love? Don't compare yourself to other people. Don't, just because you read an article on Women's Health Magazine, oh, if I don't do this, I'm not gonna get the desire. No, you work around it right? Because you're creating your story, right? Sure, you can use my story and someone else's story as a motivation, but you do it your way, right? Take my advice, other people's advice, and make it work for you. But I, what I won't let you do is stress about the things that you can't control. Sometimes you got to let go and realize, hey, it's going to be okay. I either work around it, work out another day, and not stress out. I'm gonna do an episode on this if you want <laughs> because I talk about it with my clients about, oh my God, I'm too many rest days. If I have too many rest days, I'm gonna gain weight. No, wrong. <laughs> but if you want me to talk about this on a future episode, let me know. Please do me a favor. If this helped you, drop me a comment. If you have any questions, let me know. Have the best day ever. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're a new viewer and don't forget to click on the bell so you can get notifications every time a new show releases. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and feel free to leave your comments. I'm Jason Roselle and you're watching Get Inspired with Jason.